There was an advert on the radio, which my brother heard, and instantly he thought of me. Got the phone number for me, and I called it. I expected a wind-up, but that wasn't. I went to the audition, clearly the best there, and yeah, come back and try and break the record. Some of them just laugh, but others just shout out, you pig, or <laughs> I think it's absolutely disgusting. But when they realise I'm doing it, playing to the crowd, they sort of think it's funny then. There you go. When he first told me what he was going to do, I was just so embarrassed. And when he said it was going to be on the television, I just thought, oh, no, I just won't be able to face people again. But, of course, the first time we heard it, we just laughed. We just thought it was so funny. <laughs> now everybody wants him to demonstrate. <laughs> I almost fainted once. It was so loud, so uh, forceful. I thought I was going to faint. But I'm not actually uh, hurt myself. Occasionally I get a sore throat. I do it too much. OK, I'm just clipping this onto the tripod. Right there. And uh, basically what I do is I turn it on. I was measuring sort of around 114 dB as a peak. Um, comparably speaking, you're looking at a very loud nightclub. Um, obviously, a nightclub is continuous, a continuous noise level at 115, but if Paul's Burt was continuous, it would be comparable to pneumatic drill uh, or a or very, very loud nightclub. I was in a bar the other week and uh, I was showing off in the toilet like people were asking to do it and this one guy come in and didn't like it at all and said you ought to learn some manners and he was going to smack me one in the mouth. You all right? <laughs> so. There you go. <laughs> 